<coughs> and we are live. Hello, everybody. This is Vendor Advent. Welcome back to Land of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, today we'll be taking care of the three labyrinths around. We'll apparently have parts on the ground, in the air, and below the chasm. Yeah. I, I came over here and like, yeah, I took care of this area with like all of these. It's, yeah, pretty much like to, to get uh, the treasure here, you pretty much have to go to the correct hole, I think it's this one, to land in like a caged area. Every other one just, is just around that area. But it's really funny just seeing them all clustered together like this. I also went and, yeah, took a picture of this. But, yeah, it's one of those ones that are like, the bottom falls away. And, yeah, I landed right next to this shrine. I also, yeah, went in here. Let's actually just travel here. I want to try going through the maze on the ground floor first before trying to look above or below. Hmm. Like, I do know I ended up using one of my travel medallions to just put it on top of there so every time I jumped into a hole to mark it as entered I could just immediately warp back out instead of trying to find the right spot to ascend out of every time. I know I also did, yeah, like, a little bit more work over here. But yeah, like, I... Yeah, I pretty much put that there because I wanted to, yeah, take care of, like, the little quest over here. So, yeah, like, there was a, a Korok nearby I had to take care of. Yeah, like, I came over here and I had to take, yeah, boats here all the way back uh, to Luralin Village. I also formally turned in the quest f uh, about the blue shirt from Wind Waker. And yeah, just put that there so I could yeah, easily yeah, glide. Anything else? I gotta take care of these labyrinths. I really want to work on fo uh, focusing on the sky islands. Oh, perfect. Yeah, I need to get a picture of you. Oh, that's a. Yeah, there are a higher level whiz robes. That's a media whiz robe. Not a fire one, a media one. It just dead. I got enough rods. Because 
like I could go up into the air to glide. Oh, interesting. We got all those pieces of something. Oh, we got a camp here. <coughs> Research log. Day one. According to Toro, the characters carved in the stone slab read as follows. The dragon ring slumbers in the labyrinth's depths. Wake it, and you shall receive due compensation. Okay, dragon ring, I'm thinking that's the the kind of thing we press for Zonai stuff. Because it's usually, yeah, like, the dragon circle around it. Now that Toro's going off to examine the other ones, I'm going to tough out the rest of the, this research alone. I'll leave a trail of acorns and nuts behind me so I don't get lost. Aww. get a good overhead view. <laughs> this poor man, I'm just taking his trail out. I definitely noticed that I like, put them on. They definitely uh, don't start with like the hearts open and exposed. They have to let them pop up. I searched these passages by my window, I haven't found anything. I got a good feeling about this last one. What did they keep me from exploring it now? It's a late hour. I'm trying to contain my excitement and get some sleep. this ring and enter the northeast ring and that side of this leads to a room filled with gloom and it looks like that actually is the only way forward Yeah. 
I'm not sure if I want to ascend here or not. Yeah, ascending really like breaks the rules of this maze. <sighs> Turn these off for a bit so that you just aren't in the way all the time. Too late, Marge, you're funny. Too late, I need you! <clears throat> there you are! my face into the wall to see.
I notice the treasure compass only goes off when I head down, or face down. That's obviously where to go next. I go or which way I turn, everything looks the same. It's all covered in energy sapping gloom. Somehow, managed to swallow my over my desire to run home and will attempt to spend the night here. Hope I have enough acorns to mark my way to the end. over to the last quadrant. Yep. 
can't believe I'm this, but I'm standing in front of ancient Zoai ruins. But tremendous discovery makes the terror and uncertainty of getting here completely worth it. It's a shame for me that I have no idea what these ruins are. I'll head back and report to people who might. Oh yeah, this is just a way down. Yep, South Lome Chasm. For you conquered this labyrinth of the land, I, the ruler of Boars, have unlocked a door. Find it on the north side of the labyrinth of the sky. Something okay. So yeah, now it's like telling me, okay, get to the sky. wants me to climb these things. Hmm? 
I just can't help but feel that, like, the game doesn't want me to just get glass of tower. It feels like there should be a way to get up above the labyrinth by the labyrinth. There is some convenient debris. I do want to just, yeah, see if, like, the game does expect me to find some way up here like this.
Okay, so the permit does say, yeah, you need to uh, get here with the tower. This is a can. I can't glide directly there. Uh, I will have the... might be able to build a, a glider over there to carry me this way. Look down and I saw the, the glider bird. I just made it! Now, was I supposed to do it like this? Or did I cheat to the end of the labyrinth? I think I'm supposed to, yeah, get here because this is the entrance. And I, I run, then, then run through this. Oh. Unlit blessing? Okay, yeah, well, I was not expecting it to be a launch pad. <laughs> but it's just like, oh, you think this is a simple blessing shrine? No, it ain't. <laughs> Ah. Mm 
pretty sure this would not be active at all. So you set foot in my labyrinth of the sky, I offer a test of wisdom. Four terminals are hidden in this maze. Activate them all. got carried away by the wind! <laughs> safe to say that the four of uh... yep
<laughs> okay, so there is fall damage if I fall far enough. Actually, very much like in this, the gliding maze. That's just fun and different. Oh. 
up at the very top. Just so happy it wouldn't get strong enough to lead me up there. What this is gonna do is actually open up the gate to the chasm for the that's it. I had to dive all the way down. I've traversed this maze, mark well my words. I have pulled apart the bars and the labyrinth of the land, obstructed the, your path below ground. I knew it. High above, to far below, prove your courage by diving to the, into the depths of the earth. Final way shall open to you. that on top but now I'm inside what's something good uh, someone I can put on here We got this guy, hello. This is the part where I want a spear. <laughs> this is 
time for the other weapon to break. Short-lived, very powerful. We have Traverse's Labyrinth of the Depths. This trial is a test of your talents and overcoming it. You have shown yourself in, to be uh, strong of body, skill, and mind. And my name is Ruler of Boars. I command your achievement and offer a fitting reward. I'm a reed and otherworldly evil. Hidden away since days of old, take it now. Whoa. So yeah. It's gotta be a pieces of set for every single one of these labyrinths. I have Evil Spirit Mask! Oh, that is Ocarina of Time Phantom Ganon! Some believe the eerie mask is inspired by a malevolent entity. It's a rather rare find. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Yeah, so like, this is where I fought Colgara. Again, I'm gonna put that there as a mark of I beat you. We got another shrine to go to! I'm actually very glad I ended up doing this one first because I got the head bees so I know exactly what set I'm in for. Disappointed it's another stealth set. This is our third stealth set. should be gone. It really should be out be marking off more when I kill the bosses. Yeah, I remember going in here not finding anything is just empty. When it comes to melting uh, big things of ice, one thing I like to do is just put on a fire rod and then just sit there. Because just the heat radiating off my fire wand is reducing... melt the thing. It would definitely go much faster if I actually threw out the fireballs, but it's a way to not use up any kind of, you know, just weapon points by just making it slowly melt. Okay, I can demonstrate that over here. Yeah. I 
stand next to it and you can see it's starting to melt. Rather slowly, but it is melting. Icicles. Yep, card seven to five. Read Dragon Ring Slumbers. Is, yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Good pine cones this time. technically fire. Phantom Gannon. I will admit that the, the amount of just like terror and dread that, uh, yeah, like the gloom spawn fans, I still like calling them floor masters, that they bring, definitely decreased when I discovered, oh yeah, just the strategy of, anyways, I started blasting. Definitely became a lot less stressful when I realized the answer was high explosives. I think I'll just, since I'm like, off in the stream clock, I might 
get to throw some proper fireballs. Lights here that's almost beckoning me to it. Hitting and yelling at their like seems unresponsive. I sort of feel like I may not unravel the secret of Zone after all. I thought it makes the cold even more bitter. Time I crawl out of this frigid pit and issue my report in my investigation. After I uh, get down to the bottom of this area, I might uh, ex just explore for a bit underground. Still, could be new areas.
That's telling me to look to the sky. Yep, the ruler of owls this time. chest for later because it's very likely it's going to have more weapons I can't hold yep lots of just zonite weapons I cannot hold yeah you're close to breaking anyway Is that actually keeping me warm? I get from the tower. Definitely, I uh, need to get some kind of flying device. <laughs> okay, I just—I <laughs> didn't know that was a thing I could do, but okay.
The downward angle is me meant to create upward propulsion. enough of these I can take these out. I've just been hoarding my devices to be honest. God, the platform itself. I didn't even realize the platform itself could expire. Well, at least he yeah, got close enough. What am I going to do for the third labyrinth that's so far away from everything else? Is there like a pattern? No, it's just weathering. Wisdom to find and activate the terminals. Then we have the test of courage to take a leap of faith. Then we have the test of power to defy the construct. And BAM! Yeah, just very clearly see where to go through the maze. I didn't actually do the shrine there, fudge! Yep. 
side is I'm here I may as well open it yep Another like special blessing. Like an icing on. Nope, regular shrine. Gravity and velocity. Ooh. Don't I charge? Yeah. You 
actually need the orb. Get up here! Then <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's how what I know to do with velocity. Yeah, that's definitely, I think, one of my favorite little tricks is to just, yeah, just a quick tap of recall to halt an object's momentum. one, thankfully. on top, and I'll get a big updraft. Before I jump off,
です。Now I'm actually in the dark. As soon as you get these special uh, ability of shining steps, it just means every so often I leave behind that. Yeah, cold arrow blade. Yep, next part of the Phantom Gavin set. Yep. 
evil spirit grieves. Just outside it. Kitoyam. in here now. an interest in fighting these guys any at all. So we need them a whole lot more zonites. Like a, an ascension point, then all the way to the top of Mount Drena. Sending to
Yep, so now I'm just up here. that I think yeah crossing this way sign of anything. Not much left. It definitely seems like there could be something over here. And yeah, this just screams Giga Hive out. I would not be surprised if there was a frox over this way. This seems to be exactly the type. This wide open area seems the exact type of place that they love to set up a shop. Going. 
After I take care of this little whatever it is, I'll yeah, head back up to the surface and we'll make your way to the final labyrinth. Next to him, swing. Really, basically, he built to facilitate safe and effective navigation in the depths. I'll basically follow the operation guidelines below to ensure the quick and flexible deployment of personnel. Secure all treasure and valuables, such as crystallized charges in the storehouse. Like one person, ensure the storehouse is thoroughly sealed and protected at all times. Our threatened to other personnel must immediately report to engage in hostilities. Let's see, volume one about base placement. Crystallized charge and a Yiga schematic. Whirling Basher, okay. No, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go here, glide down here, ascend to the top of here. And then glide over to the to this place instead of starting at the beach. Yep, literally right into that. This <laughs> imagine the reactions like to seeing like me pop up with my hood and then noping back down. <laughs> Ooh, 
Like, I don't think you need to, like, kick your legs to swim. But, makes you feel better. <laughs> oh! Still love, like, the link face there. I don't want to just be yeah, like a cheat your way to the end. Oh, interesting. Nice fruits. Oh, yeah, to freeze platforms in the water. Two days reached this isolated island. Ruins uh, stood before us. We we're too exhausted to explore. But weary. Turn was able to save from the zone island slab. Yep. Mm hmm. Yeah, again, we got acorns and nuts. See, at points of deeper water. Sword. How many of these different types of ones do I So I was right, there is something up there, it's just extra weapon. and ruler of dragons. Yeah, now, figuring out how to get up here is gonna be tricky. Mm -hmm. It looks 
think it's the way the depths is already open. Into the sky, I have eight, and I can turn those in for two art containers. remember like in Breath of the Wild getting around here that room just being filled with guardians like oh my god yeah and being <laughs> having a moment of terror there left this medallion up here. Oh, that's dinner all behind me. I actually managed to get most of what I needed from Dinral through a very, actually kind of hilarious uh, thing I did was I got on the dragon and literally rode it until it went underground and uh, it kind of refreshed itself so I could get the other piece I needed from it. Find the fairies who would fly into me, or allow myself so the fairies fly into me. I can't help but feel like a, a cool idea that, uh, for something they could have done was create the Great Fairy's Mask from Majora's Mask with the power to, uh, yep, not scare fairies when you are when you wear it. So you can just actually, yeah, walk up to them and snatch them and they won't try to fly away.
is to cross over this way and climb my way up here. Go get the crystal shrine puzzle. Sky mine. I kind of feel the absolute need to just put one of these on first. Whoop! <laughs> Boing! different types to see if I needed to go for another round, and I didn't. Kikaku Shran. Wait. Oh, we got a car out.
ยัยยังนะครับอีเกะเอ้อ I did the wrong one it was ยักกี้นะอีเกะplace to get in my way. I need to launch one of the cubes up here. Unless...
This should be a sage as well. Nope, the Zonite Shin Guards. That's actually even better. I just wanted to toss it and see. Tossing over the finish line. That rocket platform has reset. I'm gonna use it to cover most of the distance towards uh, the mains. I 
Could probably another one. Or I could just. Nope. Oh. Dang it, head it backwards. We'll just yep, ride this platform until it expires. And then glide the rest of the way. Oops, this is another type of fairy pool type platform. that I should be able to use this uh, area to glide over there there's definitely going to be a construct battle oh yeah a flux construct battle that'll give me a map afterwards Should definitely be good to actually make it there. Mm Courage to jump, and we're still in zero G. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh my god! <laughs> Preferable on Zonites. This is just awesome.
this! Oh my god, no. It was me to make a rocket jump. Heck yeah. Off. That was awesome! This is one of the coolest shrines! Cause this just says, have fun! Okay, I kind of like how they're not perfectly all, like, uh, lined up. Or, like, uh, a, a firm pattern. I like, yeah, these two are in kind of different areas. Area boost you just have to get low enough. Navigating this maze, uh, just like breezing through it as on the glider, is really fun and cool. It's unique, it's distinct, and yeah. Yep, uh, again, I really enjoy doing this. This is fun.
Morgan. This pretty zero is here in another chest. Oh, big battery. Yeah, just like the music here in the labyrinth supersedes the ominous music of the blood moon. That's interesting to note. actually uh, in the right area when I was just before I decided to see what's in the big room Refresh my stamina. Right into the wall. Now I get back into here.
Where's the extra chest? Still gonna come back up here. We have to glide over to that one spot. I'll open the way to the depths, go down and claim your prize. Smashing something up. Fighting the divorce. Two broken weapons. Body bees. Master of Dragons, I'm pleased you passed my trail. Here's your reward.
Yep, there it is. Evil spirit armor. this labyrinth. Yeah. Oh. Activate the light route in this area. There we go. I'm on top. Which is where the light route is. Yeah, it's all lit up now. Let's try to take a look at what is hiding outside the labyrinth. Mm -hmm. Just, yep. Isolated under the cave. Oh, but there is something up here. Another soldier four blade. of this area to go through. up top where there was a chest, but I'm not seeing that anywhere here. I 
don't know if the wind gets will, yeah, pick me all the way up again, but not taking any chances. going to get to, yeah, like the Sky Island above Eventide Island. Oh yeah, like the King Gleok then.
Heart containers. And try to figure out what else to do for the last few minutes. That's so fun. This is a fun name to say. Yeah, yeah. I see walk. I never turned in uh, the pillar I took at the, in the Gruder Desert. Let's go again. Talk to this guy. I wonder if I like, can talk to him. He'll give me any hints about of where to go next. Like, uh, I, uh, I found a text that indicates there may be a pillar uh, near this area or something. Get a little carried away. Turn my focus firmly toward the villagers. As their chief, look to me to watch over the village. Uh, always pray for your safety, Master Link. Always. Aww. Oh. I'm going to single be discovery of my career. Uh. Good birth to you, Link. This is a behind such a rich history. Crucially, pass the knowledge on to future generations. And history needs to be accurate. So, I tend to continue my work translating these online inscriptions. Thank you for all your contributions. In fact, Zelda described here. Zelda described his Sonia's distant relative. Yeah, her many countless times over great granddaughter. According to this, she arrived in Hyrule unexpectedly from another kingdom. Seems she was a beautiful princess. She made clothing for the people of Hyrule, and many were suspicious of her at first. But Zelda had such an undeniable air of nobility that those who doubted she was of royal birth were soon silenced. Ah. What a tale! Oh. So fascinating. He told individual people is virtually unheard of in text for so long ago. I'm really blessed to be researching ancient Hyrulean in such times. <laughs> uh, clearly this conveys the writer's feelings regarding Zelda. As clearly as Zelda be staying, she played to be Chamberlain to the princess. This is just real admiration. Uh. Oh. <laughs> hmm. Another one up on the wall. Ah. Uh. 
kind of filled in the gap on mm. the back wall. Oh. 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 like the need to do yeah, like slowly comb over like the map aha yes there is one here I can't help but wonder if after I find this one I'm gonna get something special for the last one or if it's just gonna be yeah find one more See, it's a stare, does it go? Got it! <laughs> yeah, let's just follow it down, because why not? Heard a strange lady. Oh, my ancient ghost story. Tang of each, I really did perfect. No ghost story when I see one. Uh. They're kind of a ghostly or maybe corpse like woman who appeared each night looking just like their Zelda. But air, there's that air. It seems people can't resist sharing a good ghost story. Oh, Ooh. yeah, like it oh. is a phantom Zelda. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> ah. Hmm. Think one on the left. Oh. Okay. Didn't do anything. So like that. Last one is just somewhere. Lookout landing, so it doesn't count. I kind of wish it would get marked off. Yeah, I was thinking there might be one hiding here uh, behind the Thunderhead, but it doesn't look to be one. No sign of that distinctly flower-shaped island. Mm -hmm. There's a few things around that I could have done but didn't do. Not the great Skyland. Yep, there it is. back around and it's staying yeah we're gonna I want to just finish this here and now mm -hmm. oh yeah turn this in see what he has to say uh, yeah, click my reward. I'm really curious to see what exactly I could be getting for doing all of this. Yeah, because I believe this is considered a side adventure. Yeah, messages from an ancient era. That will be ending, and then yeah, tomorrow we'll be really scouring all of the Sky Islands. I might just find a list of old maps, oh. so I can yeah try to check them off one by one. Oh. 
Song of King Raru's Greet the Beauty of His uh, Sister's Dance. Sister's Dance. Oh. Have a party from those days. It says King Raru and his older sister uh, sang and danced together while Queen Co Sonia looked on. Oh. It's very interesting. Think of royalty as austere and reserved. These nobles amuse themselves with song and dance. Very recounting of a scene never before related in any history book. Oh. As their personalities and expressions make the ancient past feel alive again. Yep. <laughs> and myself would think of. I possibly say to think of how the story of the ancient past is there so long and reach us today. Uh, yep. So exciting. Oh. Wait, wasn't this the final tablet? Oh. We're collecting all 13 of them! I can't believe it! Oh. Finally, I translated the whole history. You need a moment. I've read all of it. Well, to step outside my role as researcher, I'm deeply impressed with the author. Uh. First, I'd like to have met her. Why the vast gulf of time didn't separate us? Of course, collecting the 13 records of these stone tablets would have been impossible without your cooperation, Link. And if you work as a member, well, honorary member of the survey team, why don't you have this cloth? Ah, oh, sail, uh, a sail, paraglider cloth. Oh. I tell you, Link, I never felt prouder to be a researcher than today. See, all this valuable data compiled on the research that wall makes me almost overcome with emotion. Oh. Yep. Come on, look at oh. Mary like. It's a precious understanding from my analyses of the text discovered this time. This history of the chamber ain't laying left off. Uh, love for her posterity contains not just facts, an important mechanism of her feelings. Mm -hmm. What a continued research of ancient Hyrulians that can convey these feelings to the rest of the world. Thank, thank you very much for working with me on this. Yep, and right here. So, yep, that's everything. Yep, read the tablet's text and hear his translation. <laughs> well, yep, he said that's all for tonight. Yeah, tomorrow we'll be going back up to the sky. You know, like some of these shrines I haven't taken care of. But actually, I really should probably be, yeah, be marking these off uh, for the ones I, I've done. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think I'll collect this. Maybe not just yet. Yeah, like tomorrow is really gonna be focusing on clearing out the sky. And I, yeah, like I said, I might get a reference point for old maps. And also, this, there could be a lot of stages while well it's hiding up there. Lots of stuff to do. But yeah, really want to work on cleaning up the sky. But until then, this has been Devander Advent. I stream every day here on Twitch starting at. 6 o'clock p.m. U.S. Central Time. Hello. Uh, Joey DeBow for more. Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom on Nintendo Switch. Till then, good night, everybody.